bottom thermostat is stuck in the on position and it will not come open. It will go on up to 170, maybe even 180 before the top thermostat, the red reset button, pops open, killing power for the entire water heater. We'll go down look at the bottom thermostat and I'll show you how to tell if it is stuck. Okay, last night, water heater stuck on. This morning, the water was only 85 degrees. The bottom thermostat never did pop open. And this morning, the red reset was popped on the upper. It had a strong snap to it when I pushed it. It's all alive. This upper was replaced about a year ago, so I knew it was in good shape. It's a 2012 model. The bottom had not been replaced. You could feel nothing on the bottom thermostat when you turned the screw from max to minimum was nothing. And even though the thermostat was in the minimum position, at 120 degrees or 115, less than 120 on the setting. The water was coming out about 133 to 34. The voltage is still 242. So the bottom thermostat was not shutting off. It takes about 170 to 180 degrees Fahrenheit to trip the top thermostat red reset button. The thermostat completely free wheels from minimum to max, back to minimum. We still have 240 volts. That's a quick way of testing. But number one, if your thermostat freewheels, the water is about 135 degrees, tested with a temp gun up at the sink, it definitely should not be freewheeling. It should be shutting off. So that's an easy troubleshoot. Be very careful if you're not comfortable around live wires, especially 240 volts. Hire an electrician to come out or a plumber. Above all, be safe. Thanks for watching.